Pagka lovers na, dito daw kayo tumatampay ng show mo. Because no one's gonna take me on a date. Walang USD experience without a baha. Kasi irregular student ako. I don't know where this day will take me, but I'm gonna try. Okay, friends, I am tired of girl bossing. I am tired of like working, 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 and I don't know, I feel like uh, I'm having a little bit of an existential crisis because I know a lot of people say, enjoy your time alone, blah, 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 self love. I've been doing that for so long. If you guys have been watching my videos since I was, what, 22? Ang tagal ko nang like soul searching. And parang. I just came to a point na iniisip ko, what is next? I've been working on myself for so long and honestly, I haven't been that lucky on the relationship side of things and it's one of the things that I cannot control. Shempre yun, that involves another person and it's just not something that I know how to deal with. But the older I get, the, the more I realize how much I don't know. So anyway, today I was talking to Nina and she was telling me, Bakit ako magsisettle kung I have such amazing friends and my family is amazing? Like, they treat me so well, why would I settle for anything less? And it's so true. But well, anyway, the game plan for today is to <laughs> do more of the things that I want to do for myself. I used to be very good at this. I used to be very good at making my own plans, taking myself out on dates. I feel like when I came back to the Philippines and became a girlfriend again, parang medyo na ano siya. Na udlot yung pagkaganan ko. I did have a lot of fun when I was that girl. So I'm gonna be that girl again. But first, I do have something in the lobby. So I need to get my my package from Nina. Akin Hi, thank you. Thank you. Right, this was from Nina's makeup event for Color Red. But look at that. Chrysanthemums, my favorite. Absolute favorite. So this is going to the vase that again I got from another friend. This is from Frankie. Ta-da! What the ba ang gunda gunda niya. So proud of myself. I finally made it out of the house. I was able to squeeze in a quick gym session, although I didn't film because I don't know how to film with other people around. So, ayan. but anyway, sana hindi ako malit because the museum, the National Museum for Fine Arts, closes at 6 p.m. and it's currently 3:56. Alam niyo naman sa Pilipinas, we can't just go whenever we want. You have to account for traffic. So sana umabot ako. Three, two, one. Anywhere I'm at, turn the city up. I could flip a dial to a million. I don't like to brag, but I'm really on three, two, one. Sir, saan po pwede magpark ah? papuntang museum? Bawal po magpark dito eh. SM, kumusta nyo? Ah, sa SM pa. Ah, okay. Sige po. Salamat. So, I don't know what happened, but nawala na signal yung phone ko. I'm trying to restart it. So, I don't know where I'm going. I am completely useless without ways. Pero let me try to get there pa rin. I don't know. I don't know where this day will take me, but I'm gonna try. Alam mo yung feeling na sobrang helpless ka lang pagka wala kang ways or wala kang Google Maps. Yeah, but I feel like I shouldn't feel that way about my own city, you know? Okay, change of plan because hindi ko magana ng phone ko. Umabot na ako sa Kiapo, guys. So I know where this is already, and I have a good idea of where I want to be right now, and that is USD. Sobrang yung makapaniwala. I made it to Pinoval without freaking ways or anything. Ah, this is where I stayed for the most part during my first year in college kasi CFAD ako noon. That's College of Fine Arts and Design. Tapos, dito ako nagpa-park sa Pinoval. Yay! And siya. Ooh, ang traffic as usual. Guys, I did it. I have parking in USC! <laughs> I got parking in Pinoval. I can't believe it. This is honestly the most difficult thing, especially Sunday ngayon. So, I just checked the mass schedule and meron siya 5.30. Actually, now, in like 10 minutes, there's gonna be a mass, but I do wanna eat and gusto ko makita yung USD while it's still pretty 
light out. So, yeah, I'll go to the 7 p.m. mass and then kain mo na ako. Okay, kakwentohan ko kayo about my UST days. Pero before that, kakain mo na ako kasi gutom na gutom na ako, guys. So, first place we're going to is the car park. Nagdadrive na ako ever since I was in college. So, dito talaga ako tumatambay before. I have a cousin who went to um, AMV, so accountancy shop. This was her building. Sabi niya sa akin, she would always see me, but di siya maghai kasi mga dong busy lage. So we did have pancake house before, pero but siya closed. Subway, this is new to me. Okay, these are new to me too. Di masyado marami yung open na stores. I think it's because it's Sunday today, but this is right in front of the USC hospital. So I don't know, I'm kind of confused why it's closed. So punta tayo sa second place where I would buy stuff. Which is the Pitan. Dun kasi yung from second year to fifth year, dun ako nagaral sa bandang the Pitan, sa St. Raymond's building. So this one is the main building, and I only had one class there. Kasi a regular student ako. If you're an irregular student and you're really trying to ca catch up on your GEs, sometimes you really have to take classes from other colleges. So even though I really tried to get all of my classes in this building right here, that's St. Raymond's. No fifth year ako nagahabal na talaga ako graduate. So meron ako subject with the College of Science, which is such a unique experience. Parang ibang iba siya dun sa mga kilala ko sa CFAD and AB. Based on my experience, I just found them a little more quiet compared to our classes. So wala lang interesting. Dito ako dati nagpa-practice ng dance. I remember I I think I have a photo here trying to dance, just having fun with my friends. So that is the Dapitan Gate. There's also another one there, pero pare sa lang close. So hindi yung mahakain. Ano pa yung kaniyang pahabutum? But anyway, I guess we're going around. So another kwento. Of course, walang USD experience without the baha. And that one, sa likod nun, that is the Medicine Auditorium. Auditorium. <laughs> but that was the time that I was in the USD and I got stranded here because we have an event. And dahil may event, so we na that we are going to go outside. We finished the event outside. We finished around 11 p.m. Then we were going to go outside until we were in the auditorium, that building. So we were going to St. Raymond's. Tapos pagdating sa St. Raymond's, they were like, Okay, dyan na kayo. We will bring rubbing alcohol. We'll bring Jollibee for you guys. This is the Lover's Lane. And here in USD, at least during my time, pagka Lover's Lane, dito daw kayo tumatambay ng jowa mo. But even though I did have a jowa, I never really experienced that whole thing. So, bawi na lang tayo today. Kahit wala pa rin namang jowa. So, if gusto nyo mag-send sa akin a recommendation, or if you want to send a first date proposal, Okay, here's an email. <laughs> okay, but more than the lover's lane, whatever. Dito mo rin makikita yung Arch of the Centuries. I also have a photo here, I believe. And actually, dito nagsimula yung pageant journey ko. Because I joined my yung first pageant ko. It was the search for the ideal ideal college of fine arts and design personalities. Ang haba ng, ano, ng title, but... Yeah, funny enough, the second time around, I couldn't exit Arch of the Centuries because na delay ako for my fourth year graduation, so na delay ako dun. And then by the time I did graduate, after na siya ng first sem ko sa fifth year, so wala nang ganitong ceremony to exit the gate. What if I just exit right now? <laughs> Yeah, I don't remember doing this because by the time na nagkaroon ng second batch of exiting the arch, nagtatrabaho na ako and medyo wala na akong pakinan about the ceremony. But maybe this is what I've been missing my whole life. Charot. That was nine years ago. I'm 29 now. Eee, ngayon lang ako mag-exit ng arch. Eee, are you guys ready? I'm so ready. <laughs> Holy shit. Lord, thank you. <laughs> that was such a fun time. Wow, USC is so beautiful. I mean, I've always known it, but ibot pala pagka wala ka na dito, you appreciate it a lot more. to church. Did you guys know na when I was in first year, I believe, first, second year, every day ako nagsisimba. When my classes were at 7 a.m., pumunta ako dito 6.15 for mass. 
Oh hi friends. So before I leave USD, I want to debrief my experience today because hindi tayo Virgo kung hindi tayo magde-debrief. Charot. When I set out on this lakad today, I was thinking to myself, ano ba yan? I'll take myself on a date because no one's going to take me on a date. I feel so alone, blah 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 blah. But then when I got to USD, naalala ko yung college self ko. And whenever I thought about what I would tell my younger self, my college self, Lagi kong iniisip na, girl, wag ka muna mag -jowa. Focus on work, focus on your school, focus on your dreams. Don't build your world around someone else. And it was such a good reminder again today na parang, wow, I, I have the luxury I didn't have when I was in college. And that luxury is having my own time having adult resources, you know, meron akong pera ngayon. <laughs> I can finally act on my dreams. And even though palagi ko naririnig na 29 is a little old, you need to settle down, whatever. In the grand scheme of things, ako pa rin naman nagde-decide what happens to my life and how I'm gonna make it purposeful, how I'm gonna make it meaningful. And it just really reminded me of how much work I've done to get to where I am today and ang layo na rin talaga pala. Akala ko parang you know, I'm still the same girl, but I'm really not. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe, comment below and tag me on socials if you want to share it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Grabe naman dito sa Manila, no ba?